and welcome to the third bonus video for this we're now going to visit the newly constructed tram line one to get there we're going to go on the second generation trolleybus number 70. Bye. Hello and welcome back. We're now making our way through the Varshligat, the central park of Budapest. This bus is going as far as Mexico Yord, the terminus of the Metro 1, and also where we can join the tram one. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are at Mexico Yord, and here is the new tram stop, and you can actually see the diff just the, dr the dramatic difference, how it's built much more newly than stops we know and it's got information boards. The street's already quite wide. I'm guessing it was uh, had a lot more lanes before. So what are they at? We still have old trams, interestingly enough. These second generation one car trams and they couple them together to make longer trams. The next tram on this platform is in two minutes. It's not quite Mexico yield, it's near Mexico yield, I think. I think it's one stop along maybe. Hello and welcome back. Here comes our tram. China Shamega mega laws uida villa moshok meg rigig. It's not your telephone. So I finally figured out what's going on on the line. Basically half the line already existed. Then when they built the extension to the tram one, they also redid this half. So this is all original tram line. The very peculiar thing about these trams is they're not three individual tram trams coupled together. They're one big tram. And yet, as you can see, because they're non tram and yet they have brakes in between them. I'm not really sure why. It's quite strange. And it's packed as well. This is Kachoi Pungrak. Kacho Pungrak. Pungrat. Sorry. It's my making feel good. It's my 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 Robert Caroy Bye. Hello and welcome back. There's the tram 14 with a connection to them. Four connections, in fact. 
because even when the tram services themselves don't connect there are often little bits of track just to connect the tracks themselves in case they want to run divergence and things this is Le Helutza. <laughs> bye hello and welcome back here we are at Honved Kohas and here we are at Arpad Heed <laughs> Also interchanges with one of the metro lines, not too sure which one. It's the Metro 3. We're now about to pass over the River Danube under Arpad Heed itself. Make original pie, Vaj. As? As must. As make again. As a era, at at the for the. Not me. Twana bővítés. A másik. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. side of Budapest. Quite high up as well, cross over what looks like another tram line or maybe even be a railway line, not too sure. But this side has much higher ground. Here's Sent... Here's Sentlelektir. It's got its own little cover. Bye. Most itt, amit látsz, most Óbudán vagyunk, ezt a város részt úgy hívják, hogy Óbuda. És ezeket a, ezeket, a, ezeket a házgyári panelépületeket, mm -hmm. ezeket mind az én főépítés vezetőségem alapozta. Tehát ami a terep alapja Igen. tavaly alatt van, csölöpök, Igen. az mind az én főépítés vezetőségem csinálta annak idején. So, uh... So that the reason a lot of people got off there was because it interchanges with the Hive. So people change there to get to the Hive. If you don't know what the Hive is, have a look at an explanation video in the description below. Which I probably haven't made yet when I've uploaded this, so it might not be available yet. Either way, we're now in Orbuda. Ebbe belefér egy fagunak a lakószám, lakó létszáma. Okay. Közepes falu. This is Orianto, and you can see there is the biggest building in Orbuda by volume, I assume. Very big. Le lehet leülni. Ha nem érdemes, már csak egyet megyünk. Ja, yeah, oké. Okay. Ez majd nem vég áll a más? Ez már majd nem a vég áll. Then we get the menu going. Okay. Stand there again. saying that he designed a lot of these buildings not designed sorry helped build a lot of these buildings he was a builder
Most itt nem állunk meg? Most itt nem állunk meg? Vagy... Hmm. The platform seems to be staggered. Not too sure. This is one more stop till the terminus. Bye. Hello and welcome back. We're now reaching the terminus. There's some connecting tracks to another... Oh no, that's... Tramline one as well. That's interesting. We're now kind of entering a heavy rail kind of section here. There is a is villamos edge. Yes, it is a villamos edge. But why? Because it's just a siding. Yeah, it's just a siding. So there are lots of side lines connecting off to different places. Probably near other. De ez, ez nem megy vissza? Kívülvel megy vissza, de hát ezt nem várjuk meg, ha sietünk. Oké. Okay. Get off here, Bécsi út and Vörsmarty út. Nem Vörsmarty út, Vörsvári. Bocsánat. Hú, that was close. Próbáljunk ott van egy kettős, amely menet irányban van. Ide csücsüljük. Well, don't forget the tickets. Remember Dad in Rochdale Town Centre. Tut tut tut. Just gonna head out at the same terminus. So yeah, that tram's just being kept there for storage. Igen. És ez valahol megy, ez ilyen konnektor dolog. Ez a sín, ez valahol megy, ez ilyen konnektor dolog? Más villamoshoz connect? Nem. Tudja vagy csak. Ez egyedül van itt, ezen a vidéken. Nem csatlakozik, így gondolod, hogy csatlakozik, ugye? Igen. Nem ez. It's just deciding. It doesn't go anywhere. Now we're going back down the same section of line, back to where we started near Mexico Ute, and then we're going to do the other half. And as we do the other half, we will um, enter the actual new section of the line because this section. At the time the extension was renovated and basically rebuilt, but it was already here. Well, this is another part which, in which there wasn't a tram already. Because this all there was a tram here, but they just redid the stops, basically. Maybe sometime they'll actually bring new trams as well. Bye. Hello and welcome back once again. Here we pass over part of the Danube, then there's Market Siget, which you can actually get down from the bridge. That's the Market Siget, that's the Hajógyári Siget. It's Mark, it's Mark. That's Mark Siget. Oh, it's different. A couple of other islands there, or other islands. Because of the main part of the Danube. Hello and welcome back. We're now where we began our journey. So we're now going to continue in the other direction. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are at Aitoji Dun. There you go. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are at Zuglo Vashotalamaj, which if you remember was actually the, the station that a model of was underneath the reception table in university where we went yesterday. Interesting. Bye. And here we are at Egreshi Ut Hungaria Kurut. And luckily a lot of people get off here. It's also interchanges with the Metro 2. And of course this is where you can access the football stadium. Bye. And here we are at Hirschutze. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here is the other stadium. Exactly. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are again. Complicated, massive, wide.
surprise above us from tram lines and trolleybus lines. Oh, crossing over. And a bit nuts. Bye. Next it is the crossing over yeah. again. We now enter. <coughs> Kőbányút, Könyves, Kálmán, Kőrút. És majd kiírja, hogy Népliget. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are at Vajda Péterúca, which is near the Népliget, which is another little park in the city, not quite as big as the Városliget. It also has a driving school where uh, Grandpa learned to drive. Brilliant. Bye. Here is Nipley Get stop with the metro interchanges with Metro Line. I'm not quite sure, I'll probably find out in a minute. Is the Metro Line number three again? Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are, Alban. It says it for me. Brilliant. Which also serves the third football stadium along this line. So the this trail number one actually serves three different football stadiums. Brilliant. Bye. Hello and welcome back. We just passed a depot. Didn't get to film it, but never mind. And uh, this is Ferenc Város Vasútállomás. Yeah. There you go. Uh, which means there will be a railway station nearby. Can't quite see it from here, but we'll probably pass it. On the way back, I'll try and film the depot. There's a little side track going okay. again. There's a bit of a loop line over there. I can spot tall green pillars. Yeah, you can see the main line there. There it is. The railway line. Meanwhile, this is Mestautsa Kunvesh Kalman Kurut. Bye. Hello and welcome back. That. So this uh, was the original terminus of Tramline One. So from now on, it's entirely new tramline that's running along not just redone although it'll look basically the same because they were both built to the same standard you see there's a part of the railway line there most of the railway line curved off anyway we now cross the danube on um uh -huh. Rákóczi Ferenc. Rákóczi here. Rákóczi Bridge. Ott meg a Budapesti Műszaki Egyetem. Tömbiá, sőt ez még. Most már új pályán megyünk. Igen. Park, which is the first new stop along the line. You can actually tell, I think, by the, simply by simply by the title. They've now tried to give them more sensible names than bus stop sounding names with two roads. It's just an info park. And there's even a lift down to wherever it is because we're on a, a bit of a bridge of sorts. Bye. Or not, here's Buddha 
for cute Dumbo Barry. Dumbo Barry. Dumbo Barry. Dumbo Barry. Bye. Here we are at House Manor Alayosh Utsa Serimi Ut. House Manor Alayosh Utsa Serimi Ut. We left, we've left the railway line now, we've curved underneath it. Uh -huh. Funny sculpture. Bye. trams here and I remember when coming to his old flat we used to actually pass through here and I remember them building this stop the whole thing was all dug up meanwhile I can show you here the grass thing see there there's grass between the trams pretty cool huh I missed earlier when we actually curved underneath the railway line. And I think the next station interchanges with the railway. The next station interchanges with the railway station. Bye. It is Ferenc Varosh. Meanwhile, there's another side tram line there. And uh, like I promised, I'll film the bit that I missed. So this is a loop line. I think it loops around, and it heads into the depot, which I missed before. Yeah. That. 
<clears throat> so instead of taking the trolley bus back, like the way we came here, we're going to go on the Metro One um, to see the Mexico Youth Extension, which I've never actually been to because I've never actually been further than see a Chini Fuda on the Metro. One of my previous videos, the second part two bonus video, Budapest, May, first April 2015, about the no, actually it was the main video um, I was talking about, I was looking at the disused overground station at Searcheni Fudu because they basically after Hershiktar the line went overground and then there was Searcheni Fudu station but then they wanted to build an extension so they basically so the overground station is now disused and the line they rerouted it underground to the new Searcheni Fudu station to allow them to extend it to Mexico Yacht which is not far from here. So now we're going to go to the new station, Mexico Yacht, to actually have a look. Bye. Hello and welcome back. So we're now at this kind of interchange kind of place. So you've got the trolleybus there, the tram one where we just got off behind us. You've now got the railway line, there's no station here just the railway line and you, you pass underneath it in this dodgy looking subway hurrah now um as of one on Nugati Bamej so this is the approach to Nugati here's a train Got a DBT on the back and before you ask I don't know where it's going I don't know what type of train it is I don't know where it's from I just know I think it's heading towards Nugati or maybe away from it I don't know So there are actually there are more tram lines here. It's the tram line three. And these run second generation stock. So not quite as new as the four and six but definitely newer than the one we were on just now. So I've noticed that uh, unlike in Manchester, uh -oh. gone the wrong way. Unlike in Manchester, um, where the pla tram platforms are high, these tram platforms alone, the trams have three different ways of dealing with this. First generation trams have steps inside the train of the tram, as you saw, you have to, the doors open and you kind of walk up into the tram. The second generation tram, these have external stairs, so the doors are actually high up and the chair, uh, not chairs, the stairs fold out so you can get on them. As for the third generation four and six trams, they're just low floored, so there are no steps at all, making them disabled friendly, which is good. Ezzy surely has a mega law hit. Oh, yup. I don't know if you can see it, but I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if Meanwhile, here is another tram. This one bound for Mexico Yacht Metro, which I believe is that stop there. Mexico Yacht Interchange. <laughs> which is hilariously stupid. And then this close together. But uh, what the heck. Again, here's another 
tram depot to be like I was pointing out to there. Quite a big one this time. Here comes the tram. It's going quite slowly. You see the stairs there. So this is a second generation tram. Tram line number three. Tram 3 as well as the Metro one, Mexico Yacht, which officially speaking doesn't interchange with the Metro one, but it sort of does as we've just proven by walking from, sorry not the Metro on the tram one to the Metro one. There's another train there on the main line, which is now about to pass us. Igen, ez a YouTube on megy. Vaj, ale itt nem csak hámas villamos van, de 60 kilenc. Is there a tram line 69 here? Yes, ha ha ha, 69. So dirty minded. But literally, it's the tram. Whatever. So they should I stop here. There's an, that one's another 69 tram. Shut up. <laughs> so as our Mexico out. As our Mexico out. Yeah, Tim. So Tim is the tram line three and 69. So you can actually see the LED displays are different. Those ones are bright orange and these ones are green. Curious. Profit leaves. Yeah, you see the trip the not the chairs, the stairs folding up. So both those trams now leave. Got terminus here big buffer and this one continues for a little longer and there's a buffer there I'm not quite sure why a bit weird so this is quite a big interchange actually Mexico Yacht it's as a friend to Mexico Yacht it's just as a as a kis vacak as a kis vacak it's not a kis vacak it's not a kis vacak it's not a kis vacak Értem. Értem. Nem menjünk itt, hogy szerintem. Ez az. 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 Ez you can see the signs, I've noticed they've put up these little metro signs on the street lights and stuff to point out where the entrances are, which weren't here last summer. You can see one up there with the new metro symbol on. There. Meanwhile, here's the entrance down into the metro one. Paul Kellum, Make sure I've got my last ticket. We're going down into Mexico. Yacht. Just missed one now. different from um Sir Chini Fudo but the line seems to continue I think 
it's going this way. There's a little reverse siding. Maybe, or even a depot as it goes up. So there's a little depot somewhere. Oh well, we'll save that for another day. Where's Mushed Fell Medge? No. The Valami Utfent. Okay, the Valami Utfent van. It's, um, yeah, it's, um, so there is a depot overground, but this one's just going to. Hang on. So there's a depot overground, which that track leads to, but right now I think that train's just going to come round here. Or not, there's another train here. And it's empty. Well, this is the terminus, isn't it? So that's hardly surprising. Bye. Hello and welcome back. We're now leaving Searching Yufrida, where we were this morning. The next stop is Hershey Town. If you look very carefully, you can actually see the lining of the tunnel change as we go from new style to old style. Just watch very carefully. There. You see that? So we're now in the authentic half of the line. It's a bit more than half. Or is it? No, we're still running a new, I think. There's a passing train. Watch. Now. Now. There. of the metro, the older half, we're now approaching Hershuk Terra. <laughs> Bye. Hello and welcome back. <laughs> again for the third and final time today at Virch Martyutsa station. This is our closest stop so we can walk home from here. <clears throat> That's a famous London Londonist quote if you didn't notice the reference but uh, it's not my home anyway it's our cousin's home where we're staying at the moment we're actually um, just packing up and leaving later today but uh, this brings the end to this bonus video if you haven't seen the main Greetings from Budapest April 2015 video, check it out in the description. And um, tonight we're flying into London Stansted, and then we're spending a half a week in London, which will make a whole other video of its own. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe and do all that stuff everyone tells you to do. Bye. Hello and welcome back. Here we are at Budapest Airport. Is. I'll be on it. <clears throat> For someone who generally doesn't like, like air travel, I have to admit Budapest Airport is a pretty cool building. It's lovely and symmetrical and practical, unlike Manchester, which is a ugly, fugly piece of junk airport. Sorry, Dad, but it's the truth. So um, we're now, as you can probably guess, leaving Budapest. That's why we're in the airport. We're actually going to London Stansted because it's cheaper. <clears throat> so we've decided to spend a couple of weeks in London, which will be my next video. No, sorry, a couple of days <laughs> in London. That will be my next, vi next video, greetings from London. As for this video, it is ending now, so goodbye. Bye now. Are you filming me this whole time? Yep. Bye.